It's time to go into the end game with Doll Allegiance Mose. On the previous episode, we did hit max level. So right now, the only things that we got are some hails because we went and tipped Moxie. We need to basically regear this character from scratch. So what we need to do is we need to go into some DLCs, get some certain gear there. We need to go farm some specific gear from some specific enemies. Here's the skill tree. Here's Mountain Dew. Here's Grape Kool-Aid. Here is Blueberry Punch. And there's Pumpkin Spice. And I think I'm gonna probably leave it this way i feel pretty good about this skill tree we'll kind of mess around with it a little bit and see what we think it's uh, slightly different than my moserker but not by much so let's start the day off by going and getting a couple of easy gets real quick i'm thinking probably where we want to start is with the ripper <laughs> so we want to go back to the very first map in the game and we're gonna go farm our boy shiv and get ourselves the ripper deja vu we're back at the beginning what's my favorite trinket I like the fish. That way I stay safe from uh, enemy damage. Can't be killed as long as I have the fish on my on my weapon. All right, Shiv. All right, that's 0 for 1. Now, what you want to do if you want to farm Shiv, you do have to beat the game and you do need to either be on True Vault and Nerve mode or Mayhem mode because on normal mode, he won't, uh, he won't drop his dedicated drops. Don't know why, but after you beat him, come over here and trigger the save point you can also come from the droughts through the door and uh come through here and farm him but you need to make sure you trigger the save point at the end of covenant pass if you want to farm him so let's get the farming oh there we go look at that run number two and we got it and it's adapting all right at times two action skill in next two max dang that's actually a really good one holy crap <laughs> all right as far as rippers go that's a good one all right next up oh the hellfire we need to get a hellfire hi everybody i haven't died <laughs> killer b check out this gun look this gun you you stab red him lava on you yeah you stab him hi. and what happened Killer B, what'd you do to this guy? Oh, he's got little bees around him. He's a <laughs> He's got bees all around him. He's got bees. He's invincible. Oh. Is that how you looked when you <laughs> ran over those hornets? Yeah, this is what I looked like when I ran over those hornets. <laughs> how did he kill you? Well, you I, I technically him, killed you? myself. Uh, he's still here. Look at this. He's invincible, Killer B. He is, and he's stuck. Okay, now he's got a new health bar. All right, let's see if we can kill him now. Okay. This time I'll stay far away. Hold on, let me do that. Well, and now I do. Have a health bar, it? Yeah, he got the health bar back. Maybe he can actually die now. Oh well, he's he's near invincible. It feels like. No, he's invincible. That's weird. Yeah. You need that. I need this ability, don't I? Yeah. I just gotta surround myself in yellow jackets. Hold on, guys. I'll be right back. <laughs> I know a spot in the yard where I can do that. <laughs> in case you guys didn't hear the story, I was mowing the grass and got attacked by yellow jackets. Took off running. Killer bees in the front yard. I'm like... He's like hopping. He hopped over something and he goes, run! I, I'm like, why? I was like, run, run, run. Because I, I thought a swarm was following me. I didn't want her to get like attacked. She was just standing there. I'm like, <laughs> So we, we get into the patio and close it up. I don't think any followed me. I think just the, the just two that the got two stuck that... on my, my ankles. It was like they sent out their, their best and their brightest. Where, the rest of them was like, what the hell are they where, trying to do? Where did Bob and Joe go? <laughs> where the hell's Bob and Joe? Shoot, it's Renegade JP, the viewer badass. Oh, man. Sorry, oh, man. Renegade. I almost didn't see you there. Wait, what? That guy dropped two things, Killer B. The, look back at the sparklies. They look like little stars, don't mm -hmm, they? Yeah. Little, oh, it's just gold confetti. Mm -hmm. That's pretty cool. What does this guy drop? Well, Star Helix, but it's not fire. Star Helix doesn't come in fire? Okay. All right, here we are at Voracious Canopy on Eden 6, and we've come to this spot on the map, and we're gonna go over here to where the Jabber Mogwai spawns in. We need to hit him with Cryo first to split him into multiple other Mogwai, because you know, you're not supposed to get Mogwai wet, but which is funny because in this game, instead of getting them wet, you freeze them, which is what it takes to split them. Whatever, it works, you know? All right, so we got him split. We're gonna keep splitting him. We're gonna get as many Jabber Mogwais out here as we can, and then we'll use Fire in the Skagden to kill him to hopefully get a hellfire not that we really super duper want the hellfire you know what i'm saying but but it is a dull weapon and this is a completionist allegiance run so we want to get everything we got several out here let's try something let's switch to salamander with flamethrowers and just see what we can do let's see if this is enough to get the hellfire to drop i'll take any hellfire i'll be honest with you okay not looking good not looking good Everyone something. 
That's magnificent, you son of a bitch. Okay, great. <laughs> okay. Another. Okay, this is great. <laughs> All right, cool. Let's try again. <laughs> this, is, this sucks, man. All right, what am I missing here, guys? What am I missing? Oh, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> That's a times two. All right. Auto bear active bonus uh, incendiary damage at that. Nice. All right. Cool. That was weird that it took that long, but I'm glad that we got it. Okay. Let's go get a KO some. Full auto or full auto? What option should we choose, chat? Full auto or full auto? Decisions, decisions. So let's get auto bear going. And then we get our bonus incendiary damage while auto bear is out. Hellfire doing work in the hands of Moe's. Oh, geez. Oh, you know what? It just occurred to me. The reason we're dying so much is because I haven't been unlocking our other things. Ooh, embarrassing. So now that we're max level, everything should be unlocked. All right. My bad. Well, I can't wait to not have to use the Hellfire anymore. <laughs> All right, Otter Bear. Set you up. Now I shoot people with the Hellfire. Don't be fooled by this damage. It's the Minesweeper doing all the work. <laughs> I take off the, the Minesweeper, the Hellfire is all of a sudden not going to be so hot. <laughs> Alright guys, say goodbye to Captain Tron. First run? First run? Take that, you stuck up. <laughs> nope, not first run. <laughs> well, alright, well we got a Chaosin, it's not a great Chaosin. Well there we go, holy crap. <laughs> what the hell? <laughs> What? What? <laughs> Adapting fire chaos in with a good anointment right off the bat for that as well. Check the fire rate on that uh, chaos in before you what? Oh, it's burst fire. It's burst fire, not full auto. Damn it. It's not full auto, guys. It's burst fire. It seemed really good. Turns out it was too good to be true. Okay. This one's got Vanquisher rocket pod damage. Murph X, nice. Yeah, that one's full auto. It's a sub 10 fire rate. Yo, Iron Gazebo's down here. Hi, Iron Gazebo. Well, <laughs> too bad about the rolls at the bottom. There we go. That's it right there. Boom. Burst fire. What we got there? That's a minesweeper. With four and firing this gagged in with a bunch of lat off rolls on it. And another minesweeper. What? Well, that one's got three and torque cross promotion. Definitely don't want that. All right, well, it's full auto, 25 mag. All right, that's good enough, I guess. Let's go ahead and jump into DLC for the Psycho Krieg and Fantastic Fuster Cluck and go get the Bloodstar Beast. Should we go ahead and get a max level corruption now? I think we should. Colossal Tracker, look, we got a triple roll. Large, 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 and it's on grenade throw. I feel like I gotta try that thing out. Not quite a cloning maddening tracker, but that might be fun. Hey, if you're a badass. Have some grenades if you're a badass. Who wants to be a sickly skag? Fuzzpuff! That actually seems like that could be the enemy's name. <laughs> All things considered. Fuzzpuff sounds logistical. Alright, helmet off. Sponge boss. No chance. We got a problem now. <laughs> this is the end. Beautiful friend. Well, fudge. Got him. Sheesh. <laughs> Got a level rogue. All right, guys, what do you think? Bloodstar Beast first run or what? Oh, All right. Ooh, we got something on the first run. Plus ultra. Lovable rogue. Ooh, legendary, guys. Legendary. What'd you guys get? <laughs> yep. Yep, pretty much. Yep, good job. Does anyone know the best person to farm splatter skins off of? Apparently, Evil Brick and Mordecai and Dr. Benedict at the end of the, toward the end of the DLC. Those are your best options. Or Evil Lilith. <laughs> good timing on that. Really tempted to redeem through your next legendary off of a cliff. Do it. Because it'll probably be a plus ultra or prompt critical. Let's see how brave you are. Yeah, look, there we go. Pip did it. Pip redeem through your next legendary off of a cliff in the hopes that I will get the blood star beast on this run, huh? Ah, it's the class mod. I get to throw that off of a cliff. Action skill damage too. Wow. 
this is technically a cliff, right? I mean, throw it off of here. Bye. And that was a long fall. Holy cow. <laughs> that was a long way down. Oh my God. Another triple roll. Is this machine going to give us a cloning maddening tracker if we keep checking it? Is that what's going on here? Five minutes later. Come on. Uh... <laughs> hey, good news. We got a couple white items this time. Sweet. Why? <laughs> this farm is the devil. You're the devil! Finally. Next two mags, bonus shock damage. All right, that's that's good. That will do well. Gentlemen, ladies, boys and girls, cats wearing birthday hats and booties. It's day number five of the doll legions mo's and i need a new name what you guys got dollar general i like dollar general <laughs> that's a good one that one's really good i like that one a lot there he is just keep on petting this guy until he gives you a kaleidoscope oh yeah there we go kaleidoscope non-anointed because you know <laughs> yeah i've been told that this thing's always gangster lean i don't know though i think i could totally do it <laughs> I got bonked just in time. Yo, Claptrap. Man, this gun is so good. I'm glad that we sat there and pet that dude for like a year and a half for this thing. Hey, we got a loot scritori. Never mind, he's dead. <laughs> that was quick. <laughs> hey, it's viewer badass. Who wants to be this guy? He's selling hot dogs. Who wants to be the hot dog salesman? It's watch the world burn. What a weird name for a hot dog salesman. Grandpa's got moves. <laughs> Look at him go, man. You can only move your lower jaw. You cannot move your top jaw. Then you might be right. It's Grasshopper, 34-38, and he's dead. All right, guys, that's where we're wrapping it up for the day. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe, tap the bell icon for more, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Y'all have a great day.